This is lab number one, command line interface. First thing we're going to do is we're going to look at the IP address using the GUI. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up my wireless adapter. And popping up here should be my IP address, which is 192.168.0.28. Um, as you can see, this is a uh, pretty good signal strength for this device. Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to open up my command prompts. So right here is our command prompt. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get into the root directory. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to search my IP address using ipconfig since I'm on a Windows PC. And here we are. Here is my IP address, matches the one that was in the GUI. Right below that, I have the gateway address. I'm going to go ahead and write that down because I'm going to use that later. Next, I'm going to uh, display the contents of my directory that I'm currently in, which is the root directory. So there we are. There's the directory of C. I'm going to now clear my screen, typing in CLS and it's gone. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a directory, so I'm going to do md. And I'm just going to do a test directory, so test. Now if I search my directories, right there is test, so I'm going to change my directory by typing in cd test. So now I'm in the test directory, and all that's in there is a, little, a few miscellaneous files um, for formatting issues. Um, Next, I'm going to ping my local gateway. So I'm going to type ping, and then that IP address, which was 192.168.0.1. And there it's doing its ping. Four packets sent, four packets received. Nothing was lost. And then the time is down below. Next, I'm going to ping my favorite website, which is reddit.com. I'm going to export that or output it as a text file. So I'm going to do ping.text. So now that that was pinged, I'm going to look it up in my directory again, see if it's there, and right there it is. So we're good. Next I'm going to rename that. So I'm going to do ren for rename my old file, ping.text. And then my new file name, I'm going to do reddit.text. And that should rename it. So there is the renamed file, reddit.txt. Now let's delete that file. We're going to do del reddit.txt. And now it's missing. Uh, before I start recording this video, I went ahead and did the trace on kent.edu. So right here is the trace for that did uh, trace rt at www.kent.edu and as you can see we made a bunch of hops and then we had a few requests time out however the trace was completed next I'm going to go back to my root directory and we are going to get rid of the test directory so just make sure it's there right there's the test directory we are going to remove it, so we're going to do rd test. Now, when I type in dir for directory again, it is now gone. And that's it for lab number one. Thank you for listening and watching.